Good morning. Okay, so I was purging earlier this month and I ran across some old polymer charms that I used to make. These are the ones that I just couldn't let go. But I was like, wow, I think I want to get back into clay. So I looked online because I was lazy and didn't want to go to the store for a toaster oven. And usually you can find a very inexpensive, about $20 toaster oven for clay. And I know some people may say, why don't you just stick them in the oven? People stick them in the oven. Um, you really shouldn't craft in a place that you cook for your family. So that's why I would not just stick them in a oven. So anyway, I looked for a small one for about $20 and had no luck. Nowadays, everything has an air fryer attached to it or does some kind of strange convection. And I just wanted something for crafting. So I saw this mini toaster and I thought, oh, cute. It comes in colors. It'll be great for my crafting space. So you get to join me for my unboxing of this mini toaster. Oh, mind you, it is so much smaller than I thought. But it, it does say mini toaster, but I thought it would still be like a little countertop size toaster oven. I'm also a little bit concerned because I'm not sure um, where the temperature settings are. Once again, I just wanted this for crafting, just for a hobby, um, and probably possibly getting back into polymer clay, either charms or beading. I think it's adorable that it comes in this seafoam aqua, but look how tiny that tree is. Like, really? So anyway, if it works, it's gonna be just amazing. If it doesn't work, it's gonna be ridiculous because it is small. All right, so, I mean, it doesn't even take up the space that I allotted for the craft room. So here it looks like I have it upside down. But look how tiny that tray is. Let's see, what can I put over here to help with perspective? Oh, I can show you this little storage tray. Isn't that crazy? And that's about a third. Okay, so there's the oven door. So I definitely have this upside down. If it works awesome, they'll get some great reviews online. It was $9 more than I wanted to spend because I just wanted to do, oh my goodness, it's so cute, sorry. Okay, sorry. My screen says that um, the rotation of the design is locked, so I'm not sure what will be seen on this video. But look how cute he is. He's super cute, super, super cute, but so, so, so tiny. Um, let's see. This will be my timer. But I wonder where the temperature is. I would only need to get something up to about 200, 250 or 75 degrees for polymer clay. But here it is. This is, let me put the box next to it, sorry. It is called, I guess the brand is Dash and it is a mini toaster oven. And it says it's 550 watts. It's definitely cute and compact. Um, the cuteness, I really didn't care so much. I just needed functional. So we'll find out how functional this will be for what I need. But thank you for watching. This was the unboxing of my mini toaster oven. Interesting. All right. I'll let you know.